Hello Capricorn, welcome to my channel. I am the Unlikely Channeler, and this is your astro your intuitive astral astro oracle report for the month of December of 2023. Again, this month I'm going to give you four segments. The first segment is the underlying energy for the month for the sign of uh, Capricorn. The second segment is the overall message for the month of December for Capricorn. The third segment is a message on what you need to know most, what universe wants you to know most. And the fourth final segment is advice on how to navigate the month easier. Um, I wanted to remind you to please like and share my videos and subscribe to my channel if you haven't done that. I also want to tell you that the full moon is on December 26th in the sign of Cancer. And the, uh, the new moon is on December 12th in the sign of Sagittarius. When I was making, uh, when I looked it up and I, I was figuring out when the new moon was, the message I received when I wrote it down said, ask yourself what energy will dictate your life. That's the message I received as I was writing that down. And so I just wanted to pass that along to you because that is really a good question to ask. What, what, what energy will dictate my life? Also, as a reminder, I want to, I want to remind you that I am an intuitive, conscious, trance channeler to automatic writing. This message that I'm going to read to you today is a trans channeling through automatic writing. So I will read that to you, uh, the first part of this video. And then later on, I will uh, pick a, a deck of, of either Oracle cards or a, a tarot deck and give you some additional information. And mostly it's just for fun, but it's additional information for you to be able to use for this month of December of 2023. Okay, Capricorn. For December of 2023, the underlying energy is this. This is the transmission. The realization of the path that you have that you have led has created a gratitude for things that you seem seem to have lost over the trials and tribulations of the recent past. It allows you to release the pains and begin to dream again. So the, real, the realization of the path that you have led has created a gratitude for things that you seemed to have lost over the trials and tribulations of the recent past. And it allows you to release the pains and begin to dream again. The next segment is the overall message for Capricorn for the month of December 2023. This is the transmission. Pursue your dreams. Pursue your options. You are entering a mode of attraction that will attract the things you want. The restraints that have held you back are loosening and the weight of uncomfortable, of uncomfortable process is lightening. The weight of the uncomfortable process is lightening. You have, you have some emotional feelings to deal with from the height, from the lightening of the load, from the lightening of the load, but the overall view of all the events that have transpired lead you into a mat an atmosphere of comfort, friends, and productive advancement. The details you have designed into your life should not be put on the back burner. Let them continue to inspire you and your life. The low blows you have been dealt can lead to your self delusion of reconciliation. Stand your ground. You are surely rebounding. That will, you will probably have to listen to again. The next segment is a, uh, a message about a message for what you need to know most. This is the transmission. The plans you are making have the energy of not solidifying. 
the events that seem to be moving ahead are affecting your life and creating frustration that you had gotten past. Thread lightly, your emotional repair is sure. The plans you have you the plans you are making have the energy of not solidifying. Maybe we should look at that. Uh, the next segment is advice to navigate the month. Hold this transmission. Hold on to your faith of self. You have been on the path to being fully happy, and ultimately, it pays off. You have a life-changing opportunity at hand. August is coming. August is coming. August is coming. Huh. I wonder if something's going to happen for you between now and August. So that's the uh, tra- that's the the um, the channeling that I did for Capricorn for the month of December of 2023. Let's take this deck of cards and see if we can. I would really like to clarify this statement: the plans you are making have the energy of not solidifying. What what plans are you making that may not solidify? Recovery, recovery fell out. The recovery card fell out. What else does the universe want you to know? What else do the angel, angel energies want you to know? Capricorn, December 2023. Let's see what else we can, let's see what else we can find out. Okay. The first card is a year from now. A year from now, you're going to know how um, how you your plans, the plans you are making, have the energy of not so, 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 um, solidifying. A year from now, you're going to know. It's going to take some time to solidify those if they're going to solidify. Because the next uh, a year from now, the next card is communicate clearly. And the next card is opportunity. You have a lot of, this is the transmission I'm receiving. You have a lot of opportunities coming your way. You have a lot of opportunities You have um, recovered. You have recovered your enthusiasm for life. I'm just not. You have you you feel like um, the plans that you have made in the past really didn't come to um, the way you wanted them to come to, and so now you might have a little bit of fear that. Um, what you're hoping for may not come to be. And what you need to do is communicate to yourself clearly what it is that you want. What is it that you want in your career? What is it that you want in your relationships? What is it that you want in your financial health, your financial um, realm? Because you have a lot of opportunities come that you have a lot of opportunities that you may have passed over because of decisions that you were trying to make in different parts of your life. Because you have not, you, you are in a transition that may be a little uncomfortable right now. But with a well-designed plan, the right people come into your life. The right people are around you to support you. 
and you will recover in all the areas that you want to recover in. So the plans that uh, that you are making have the energy of not solidifying. It's going to take some time for you to see them either pass and you realize that it was not the right uh, plan to be making or that it has solidified. So just hang in there. Just hang in there. You have people around you that are helpful. You, if, As long as you communicate clearly, you will be able to... Uh, know, yourself know, that you have, you, you know what you want. You're not going, you're not just taking, um, taking what comes, you're not taking what comes anymore. So let's just give you a little bit more. I'm going to pick a couple more cards. Uh, the butterfly card came up. It says, a change for the better. A change for the better is coming. That's awesome. Uh, the horse card was the underlying card. Uh, there, You might be taking a short journey or you may have just been coming back from a short journey. And the next card is the rooster. The rooster says, an arrogant, boastful person you should not cross. There might be somebody in your life that does not, that might be calling to you, but is not a good choice because they are arrogant, they are boastful, and they're self serving. And then the last card I'll put pick is this is called the kangaroo. <laughs> the kangaroo says, unsettled times need to plan ahead and that's kind of what that's kind of what your message said is is things might be unsettled right now but you do have a change for the better coming you'll know a year from now but within the next the next few months your movements will um will start showing how how that resolution is going to come. It's going to take a few months. It, it's not something that you're going to know next month. It's going to take a few months to kind of settle in and really feel like uh, things are moving in the right direction and that you have started to accept those things that are coming to you instead of resisting them. And the only kind of warning that you have is that there these are unsettled times and that you need to plan ahead, but that there is a boastful, um, an arrogant, um, possibly an arrogant person in your life that you need to be aware of and either not um, pursue them, stay in that, um, in that relationship. And to make sure that you do not cross them because they can cause trouble for you. So communicate clearly. You, in, you are in a recovery time, but the opportunities and helpful people in your life are really powerful and they will really help you. They will really come through for you. But you also have to know what you want. It says, pursue your dreams, pursue your options. You are entering a mode of attraction that will attract the things you want. Know what you want. Add to that what energy do you want to dictate your life. a really good month um, Capricorn it may be a little bit uncertain right now but it feels like it's going to everything's going to turn out really well it sounds like you've come into this time also at, in a kind of an un, not unstable personally unstable but an unstable 
energy, but that because of that, you have really learned a lot of things. You've learned what you like, what it is what you like. You've learned how you like to do things. But you also do have to release. And the recovery might just be telling you this recovery card, it fell out. This recovery card might be telling you um, to release the pain and begin to dream again. That's really the bottom line is release the pain and begin to dream again. And in a month, in a, in a few months, you'll be able to say, wow, that really got me on the right path. And in a year, when you look back, you'll say, wow, that is what I needed to hear today. That's what I needed to hear. It's going to take some time, but you are on the absolutely right path. You've got the opportunities in front of you, and it's just a matter of giving yourself some time and, and letting it happen. So have a really good month. Please like and share my videos and subscribe to my channel if you have not subscribed yet. And um, stay tuned because there's a lot more to come.